power of suggestion is very real, whether it's used for good or evil. Now, I'm going to tell you about a conversation I had with a person one day. This person, we'll call them, we'll call her uh, Ann. Ann came in from work one day, and she said, Rita went to the ER. I said, uh, what'd you do? She said, nothing. Well, yeah, I guess I did. I said, what'd you do to her? She says, well, I just told her she looked bad. She didn't look good. She looked pale. So Rita got swarmed with this person, Anne. We'll call her Anne, which is evil, by the way. She got swarmed by the power of her evil suggestion. So Rita went to the ER, and of course the doctors pumped her full of stuff and gave her shots and everything else, which of course made her sick. Are you getting this? The TV, radio does the same thing. When you're even slightly medicated, evil power of suggestion can make you worse. So the person I was talking to, Ann, I told her, I said, you're supposed to use your powers for good. And she said, yeah, I know. But see, Ann and Rita didn't like each other at work. Rita was Ann's boss. So she used her powers negativity to do evil. Now, there is good and evil in the world. Now, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to use my power of suggestion in a positive way. I suggest you get off all your meds and everything and see these people for what they really are. That is an absolute true story. When she came in, she said, Rita went to the ER, and I said, what did you do? And she said, well, I didn't. Well, yeah, I guess I did. She suggested she was sick, so Rita went to the ER. And, of course, she got pumped full of stuff and I ain't going to tell them what's wrong with her now. I'm plugging on drug. That's my spiritual advice. Yeah, they got skills, too, the evil ones. And they're using them on Facebook. And they're using them everywhere.